my name is Dr. Latasia Sheree Jones. I am a recent graduate from the Biomedical Sciences Department in the College of Medicine at Florida State University. I graduated with my PhD. I went to Virginia State University for my bachelor's and my master's. My first year, there was a internship posted on the wall in my building for a research position at the College of William and Mary. And I got a yes out of it, and I worked on my first research project as a freshman. I continued in Dr. Harris' lab and worked on my master's. In the end of my master's, I talked to Dr. Harris about traveling, and I said I would love to go to Ghana, Africa. I just found out my family ancestry was linked to Ghana, and he found an opportunity with another school to go to Ghana and not only take classes, but do outreach in some of the schools there and be able to teach science and math and English to the students. I love doing outreach. Um, I'm a part of seven different organizations right now, some of them which have something to do with STEM, some of them that don't, but all of them have something to do with outreach within the community. Anybody know what density is without looking? Not One of the organizations that I am a part of is called the Young Carver STEM Academy, in which we go to some of the schools, the underrepresented schools in the community, and teach anything from science to technology, engineering, and math. Today, as part of one of the activities with the Young Harvesting Academy, we taught the young kids about density using four different liquids and each one of them have a different mass and seeing which one was the more dense versus less dense. And it also provided them a, a different way of teaching them by doing hands-on activities. Oh my God, look at mine! And providing an artwork that a lot of people don't realize, you know, making things fun and giving them something that looks fun it, it usually helps with teaching as well. Thank you, Dr. Jones! So I decided to now start applying for PhD programs. And this is where my journey at Florida State University began. And I started the program, and five years later, August 5th, that just passed by, I graduated with my PhD in the lab of Dr. Pradeep Paday. My lab was amazing. Um, I have anywhere from a few faculty members to another graduate student and undergraduates and med school students that work in the lab on a constant basis. I admire and I appreciate the most from Dr. Bidet is his mentoring, his ability to advise me on the personal level but mostly on um, a development level within my career. I definitely take a lot from that. Currently, I have just accepted a position, a postdoctoral fellow position at the Children's National Medical Center in Washington, D.C. I will be working on prenatal conditions, um, when anything that affects children, autism, um, neuronal migration to damage, and so on. My family is the biggest motivation in my life. Nobody in my immediate family had a college degree when I started. Um, as soon as I started school, my mother was motivated to go back and she completed her degree. And my sister started, my dad started, and eventually they got degrees along the way, way as well. I have stopped a cycle within my family, which is, you know, for, put the education on a lower level as far as priority compared to everything else in life. There's many times where, you know, I wanted to quit, but instead of being too nervous or fearing it too much or quitting, I studied harder or worked longer hours or slept less or cut off more of my social life to get the job done to reach the goal. The moral or the lesson to that is it showed me my strength. I, I know I'm stronger than the Latasia that I knew in 2012. 2017 Latasia can take any challenge. So I would say just go hard or go home. Do, do your best at whatever you're gonna do and leave a lasting impression, don't know who you're gonna impress at the end of the day.